concern, Dave, and that's because no one knows for sure where those dogs are. And Terrell Jackson, everyone is concerned about his health, and he does have a message for other pit bull owners, and he is a pit bull owner himself. He says, keep your dogs on a leash. The doctor said there are so many stitches, he stopped counting. There is concern about healing because 38-year-old Terrell Jackson is a diabetic. This all follows an attack by two dogs back on September 13th. I started kicking and hitting him and stuff. You know, I got him off and started fighting, actually, just started fighting. Terrell was getting out of a car in the driveway of his fiance's home on Faust in Detroit when he says a pit bull and a Rottweiler started mauling his legs. Neighbor Siggy Horn tried to help, finally throwing a propane tank at the dogs to stop them. I'm hitting them like this with the, with the gate, like this. They mangled them. They mangled my legs. A child wouldn't have would a chance. Die. A child would die. Terrell was rushed to Oakwood Hospital with severe injuries. His girlfriend took some pictures. He had emergency surgery and stayed in the hospital for three days. I was terrified. I was scared to death because he was in bad shape. I wasn't thinking about the pain at the time because it didn't hurt right then because I guess the adrenaline because I was got to get these dogs off me because uh, they could kill me. Here's the frightening part of the aftermath. The dogs have never been found. It was reported they were staying in the backyard of a vacant house about three blocks away. But Terrell says when animal control went there, the dogs were not there. Hopefully they're healed. They're pretty bad, but hopefully they're healed. Got God on my side. You can't lose. Neighbors are telling us a few days before Terrell was attacked, the dogs were down in this area trying to attack them, going near a child. They say they took that pile of sticks over there, and they tried to beat the dogs away, and the dogs did go away. Now, we went to the house where the dogs were reportedly staying, and they were not there. The woman next door said the man who was staying in that vacant house moved away. She says he shot one of the dogs before he did. Of course, we have no confirmation. That's what the woman is saying. But if that's true, there is still one of those dogs out there. This is on Faust near Tyreman, and everyone should be on alert in this neighborhood. Reporting live, I'm Cheryl Choden, Channel 7 Action News. You really have to be on alert, Cheryl, especially with dogs like that running around. All right, thank Absolutely. you so much. Mm -hmm. Seven is on your side with ways to avoid getting bitten by a dog. First of all, don't run. The dog's instinct is to chase you. Don't make eye contact. Be as relaxed and as still as possible with your arms down at your side. Now, if the dog does attack, give it anything you have, like a purse or even your coat. Curl up and protect your head with your hands. I know it's hard to do, but it could save your life.